Good morning, my Hope Huskies. We hope you enjoyed another long weekend. I'm AJ. And I'm Kobe. Today will be probably snowy. Precipitation is 70%. Humidity is 66%. Wind at 6 miles an hour. And the high will be 39. And the low will be 31. A reminder for all students, there are only 10 days of quarter two left. What an episode this week, huh, Tim? And what an episode it was. This really easily was one of the best of the season. Good morning, my Hope Huskies. We hope you enjoyed another long weekend. I'm AJ. And I'm Kobe. Today is C-Day. A reminder for all juniors and seniors, portfolio presentations are fast approaching. Please make sure you have it prepared for March 16th. Presentations will take place across the whole entire school day, and there will be no live classes that day. For this year's presentations, students will have the option to present virtually via a Google Meet or in person. Survey will be going out to students where they will choose how they intend to present as well as request a time for their presentation. Surveys need to be completed by February 1st. And requests will be honored on a first come, first served basis. Now, on to weather with JMO and Caden. Hi, this is James Canario, and welcome to your uh, weather for this week. Today will be partly snowy, precipitation of 70%, humidity is 66%. Wind at 6 miles an hour, and the high will be 39, and the low will be 31. Wednesday. Tomorrow will be a high of 39 and a low of 31, with some snow and some showers. The pre precipitation will be 60%, the humidity will be 86%, and the wind will be uh, 6 miles an hour. Thursday will be a high of 36 and a low of 11. Precipitation at 40%, humidity at 69%, and wind at 12 miles an hour. It will also be partly snowy. Thank you. This has been your weather this week. Now back to the desk. A reminder for all students, there are only 10 days of quarter two left. Please make sure you're all caught up on your work and end the semester strong. Music Cafe for quarter two will debut on YouTube this Thursday at 7.15 p.m. This show will feature a virtual winter concert with vocal ensemble, symphonic band, and guitar ensemble. Also, many of last year's seniors who missed out on their farewell concert due to COVID will be performing as well. It will be premiering on the official Mount Hope YouTube channel. Hey Kobe, have you seen the new episode of WandaVision? It was pretty weird. I have, and I have no idea what's going on in it. Let's go to Tim and Jacob and see if they can make sense of the new episode. Welcome back to WandaVision Review. My name's Jake. And I'm Tim. What an episode this week, huh Tim? And what an episode it was. This really easily was one of the best of the season. I agree. I think we've learned the most about what's going on in this episode. Things start to get weird as Wanda's pregnancy goes from three months to nine months in a matter of minutes. Oh, I know. That was definitely an interesting scene. I'm excited to see what happens to her kids, as in the comics, they turn out to be mutants. I agree. I'm excited to see what they do with their story. Now let's talk about Monica Rambo. For those who don't know, that was the woman Wanda threw out of her simulation. She's most likely an agent of S.W.O.R.D., and I'm very excited to see how she ties into the story. Absolutely. I have a feeling this isn't the last you're going to see of her. And something tells me that next week, S.W.O.R.D. is going to play a very large role, especially now that Wanda's kids have been born. Anyhow, that's it for this week, and we'll see you all next Tuesday. Be sure to visit our website and f follow us on all our social media. You don't want to miss out on the latest Husky news. That's all the news we have for you today, Huskies. Have a great day. And, and remember, remember to get, to get ripped. ripped.